My name is Gary Knight. I'm 49 years old and I'm British. I'm a photographer and I teach storytelling at Tufts University in Boston in the United States. The motivation to start came when I was a very young man, when I was 15 or 16 years old. Uh, there were a lot of reasons why I found this career very attractive. And one of them is I was raised in a small town in the middle of England, and I really wanted to go out and see the world. I was desperate to uh, escape, to go off and have adventures. It was a very big motivation. I started off my career really photographing the war in Cambodia between the Khmer Rouge and the Vietnamese army. But I never intended to be just a war photographer. I was very intrigued by war, um, but I, I never imagined that that would consume my life as it, as it did for a little while. Most people would consider to be dull or boring. There are magic things. You know, the cherry tree that's in blossom, it's, it can be magic when there's no leaves on it also. So I took this to heart and a lot of my work now is really focused on, on the ordinary because a lot of my previous work was really focused on the spectacular and now I want to slow everything down and really try to find magic in ordinary places. Um, so I don't, I tend not to have too many um, preconceived ideas about, you know, I go somewhere, uh, I have people who I meet, I go to certain places and then from those people and from those places I explore new places, find new people um, and then photograph my way through something and at the end determine what can be done with the photographs. I had a wonderful experience in, in Korea. Um, I'd been to Korea before uh, on a couple of occasions. And then in Seoul, in the, in the capital, I was, it was really quite remarkable. It, it was Seoul is such an enormous city and it has such a presence. And um, it's, it's a beautifully designed and created city, you know. It's really a very ambitious project, Seoul. And I started to get really intrigued. Uh, in the city. Uh, the, on the last trip to Seoul, I was reminded of a conference I was at in, in Singapore a few months earlier where a political scientist called Parag Karma said the 21st century will not be defined by China, by Brazil, by Russia, by the United States, but it will be defined by the city. So my next project is called Metropolis, the re-emergence of the city-state. And it's looking at this network of global cities that are drivers of technology, innovation, the centers of capital, centers of immigration, and centers of, of culture worldwide. And the first place I'm going to start is Seoul, South Korea. A global documentary that'll take you from Abu Dhabi to Yokohama. The journey starts in 2014. Beginning with 